Look, up in the sky. Hey there, Super Kids, and welcome to Super Kids, your number one source for youth fitness and wellness. My name is TJ, and I'm your own know, personal trainer, and it's right here where we work out together in our living rooms. Now, boys and girls, get ready because we have an amazing yoga guru named Jessica Shah who will help us get through these videos. Now, boys and girls, get ready because in this particular yoga video, we will be needing the following items. Your bare footsies. Wait, what are you doing? Oh, oh, no. Uh, one exercise mat. Yeah. And your water bottle. Make sure there's water in that water bottle. Hi, Super Kids. Did you know that in yoga, just like in all other forms of exercise, it is really super important to have strong abdominals. So we're going to focus on that today in this yoga session, doing all our cool, fun yoga stuff while focusing on our abdominals and getting strong, strong, strong. So let's start laying down on your back on your mat and give your knees a squeeze, hug them to your chest, just to stretch out your hips and your low back a little bit. Just give them a little squeeze and let's pull the right knee into the chest and take your left leg all the way straight. Take your right arm out to the side and we're just gonna take a spine twist here, just to stretch out your back a little bit. Lengthen the lower back, open up the chest and shoulder and just stretch that back, twisty, twisty, twist. Reach the right arm away from you and the right leg away from you, opposite directions. And then slowly come back to center and we'll change sides. So pull your left knee in, give it a squeezy squeeze. Make sure your right leg is super straight on the mat. Take your left arm out to the side and then go ahead and twist across your body. So your right left knee and left arm are reaching away from each other. Two directions, twisty twist. Open up the chest and shoulder. Breathe, always taking those full yoga breaths. Big inhales, big exhales. Filling up the body with breath and letting it go. And then come back to center and squeeze those knees in one more time, squeezy squeeze. And let's get to work on some abdominal exercises. Some very yoga super kids abdominal exercises. Hold your head up in your hands and take your legs up to the sky. Okay, so what you're gonna do is lift everything you can up off the mat. So that's hips, chest. So you're gonna have as few bones of your back on the mat as possible. So ready? One, two, three. Lift up, lift up, squeeze, hold. And then put it all down. And then again, lift up, lift up, squeeze, hold, and put it all down. And then again, everything goes up, 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 lift, 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 and down. And then lift, 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 squeeze, pull that tummy in, pull it in, pull it in, pull it in. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. And down one more time. Lift up, lift up, lift up, and put it down. Good. Okay, now take the arms straight up over your shoulders and you're going to lift your head up and you're going to lower the right arm and left leg, so opposite. <clears throat> Reach and hold, opposite arm and leg and then come up. So this is working your coordination as well as making your abby stronger. So now right leg, left arm, reach, reach, reach. The other arm is right up over your shoulder, over your face and come up. Other side. Right arm, left leg, reach it down, 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 reach, pull that tummy in, pull it in, pull it in. And lift up, and lower right leg, left arm, reach, 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 reach. And lift, I know these are hard, and left leg, right arm, I feel it too, and if your neck is getting tired, it's okay to put your head down, as long as you keep the exercise going. And lift up, and right leg, left arm, reach, 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 reach and up, and right arm, left leg, reach, 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 and up, last one, and right leg, left arm, reach, lengthen, lengthen, oh, and up, and release, good. Hug those knees into your chest, and rock and roll a few times on your back, just to massage out that back, that spine. One more time, and then sit up, 
Now, what you're gonna do is bend your knees, feet flat, hip distance apart, okay? And we're gonna take our hands behind us, under our shoulders, fingertips pointing forward, and we're gonna go into a position called table. So, we lift the hips up, and make our body nice and flat and straight like a table. So, like, as if someone could sit on you, but you don't want to let someone sit on you right now. So squeeze that tush, and if you want to drop your head back, that is okay, or you can just keep looking up or looking forward. So make sure you're nice and lifted. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. I know it's working the arms a lot, and the whole back side of the body, and then slowly put it down, and just have a seat, and shake your hands out, your wrists, Give it a little shaky, shaky, shaky. And then we're gonna do it again. So hands behind you, under your shoulders, fingertips pointing forward, feet flat, and lift up. Lift, 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 lift. Pull your tummy in, squeeze the tush. Lift up, lift up, lift up. Work those arms. And then slowly, 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 put it all back down. Okay, so now, we're going to up it, make it one harder. So straighten your legs, take your hands behind you. This time your legs stay straight and you're going to lift up. Ready? Here we go. And lift up, lift up, lift up. Try to get your toesies towards the floor. Try to touch them to the floor. Lift, 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 lift. And lower down. Take your arms and give your hands and arms a little shaky, 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 shake. And then one more time. Hands behind you, ready? And lift up, try to reach those toesies to the floor. Oh my God, that's so hard. Reach, lift, lift your hips, lift, 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 lift. Helps me to wiggle my toes. And put it all back down, my goodness. And shake it out, good job. Okay, so let's come around to our hands and knees. And you're gonna tuck your toes under and lift your hips up and back to downward facing dog. Rotate those arms open around the ears. Lift those hips up. Now let's lift high up onto our toesies. And put the heels down. And again, lift high up on the toesies. And put the heels down. One more, high up. And put it down. Okay, so we're gonna continue focusing on the abdominals. So, take your right leg and lift it up so it's hip height. And now, you're gonna come forward into a plank position and then pull your knee in toward your nose and round your back. So feel your abdominals squeezing in, squeezing in, squeezing in. Oh my goodness. Lift the leg up and put the foot down. Other side. Lift the leg up and then pull your knee. You're going into plank, so your shoulders are over your wrists and your knee is into your nose and you're squeezing your abdominals and then lift the foot up and put it down. Okay, now lift the right leg up again. This time, come into a plank, take your right knee to your right tricep, your right upper arm, squeeze it, squeeze that right knee into your arm, use those abdominals and then lift up again, three-legged downward dog and put it down and left leg up and then come into a plank, shoulders over wrists, and pull the left knee to your upper arm. Pull it in, squeeze, 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 and lift it up and put it down. Guess what, we have one more to do. This time, lift your right leg up, come into that plank, and twist your right knee to your left upper arm. Twist it, twist it, twist it, feel your obliques, oh my goodness. And then back to three-legged down dog, and put the foot down and lift the left leg up, and now twist it across, twist it across, come into plank, twist it across, get the knee to your upper right arm, oh my gosh, and back up to three-legged down dog, and put the foot down. Now just come into plank and hold. So we're holding this upper push-up position. Breathe the lift, abdominals in, long spine, and then lift the hips up and back to down dog, and again, come forward to plank. And we'll keep moving this time. And then up and back to down dog. And forward to plank. And up and back to down dog. And forward to plank. And up and back to down dog. This time, walk your hands all the way back to your feet. 
What a nice break for those arms and upper body, right? Just let them hang and let your head hang. Give it a little shake. Say no with your head. Let it go, let it go. Let yourself hang. And so now you're gonna, we're gonna play a little game where we're walking out through down dog to plank and then walking all the way back to forward bend. Okay, here we go. Walk, walk with your hands all the way to plank and hold. Hold, put your tummy in, we're working the abdominals. It's a very strong plank. Squeeze it in, squeeze it in, squeeze it in. And then walk, 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 walk all the way back to your forward bend. Oh, goodness. And we're gonna do that again. And walk, 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 walk. You're in your plank, you're pulling your tummy in. Hold, 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 keep the stomach working. And then walk, 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 all the way back, forward bend, right away we go again. Walk, 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 and all the way to plank, tummy in, shoulders forward, hold, hold, hold it, hold it. We hold a little longer each time, don't we? And that's really hard. Almost there, and then we're gonna do one more after this. Here we go, back, walk, 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 walk forward, bend right away again, last time. Walk, 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 hold the plank. We're holding it the longest this time. Hold it, feel your tummy working. Breathe, long and slow breaths. Breathe, 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 tummy in, tummy in, hold. Just a little longer, just a little longer. A couple more breaths. Get ready to walk back off, oh, finally. And walk, walk, walk. And hang over those legs. Oh, good job. That was tough. So now we're just going to bend your knees and roll up one vertebrae at a time, all the way to standing, all the way to standing, all the way to standing. Take a big inhale of those arms and exhale, release your arms. Okay, let's come to the top of the mat. Adjust your mat if you need to and come to the top of the mat. And then stand nice and strong with the tailbone long. That tummy should feel nice and strong. We've been working it a lot. And inhale the arms up. And exhale, swan dive over your legs. And inhale, lengthen, look up, fingertips on the floor. And then walk back to plank. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Okay, so now we're gonna work on a side plank for your oblique. So put your right hand right below your shoulder. Rotate onto the right foot and stack your feet. Now, if you're having a hard time balancing, go ahead and put the front leg in front. If it's really hard and you just can't stay up, go ahead and bend the front leg to modify. You can just push into that left foot. Hold, hold, hold. Otherwise, keep your side plank, keep your side plank, keep your side plank. Lift, 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 lift. Breathe, 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 breathe. Keep lifting. Try to balance. Maybe reach your arm over your ear if you can. Reach, 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 and then back to plank, and we'll do the other side. Hand to the middle. So the full version is with your feet stacked, and if you want to modify, you can put a foot in front like this, or all the way in front like this. Otherwise, stack the feet. Lift up, lift up, lift up. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Maybe reach your arm over your ear. Lengthen and lift. And look down, come back to plank, put your knees down, oh my goodness, and sit back in child's pose. And let's take our hands back behind us and just let it go. So let your body sink into the floor and release all that work. That was a lot. You should be very proud of yourselves, working hard through that all the abdominals, all the strength of your upper body, lots of breathing, and then press yourself up, and let's lay down on your back. We always, at the end of every yoga session, no matter how long or short it is, you want to take a little relaxation called Shavasana. And Shavasana literally means corpse pose. So, you want to lay there like a corpse. Go ahead and let your legs plop out, let your arms plop out. Close your eyes, palms facing up. 
and just slow down your breathing. So take long, slow inhales and long, slow exhales. Just a couple like that. Big, long, slow inhale and big, long, slow exhale. And then just breathe very naturally, letting your body be very heavy, sinking into the floor. Nice and heavy, released and relaxed. Just breathing, just natural breathing. Make sure you feel really heavy, like you weigh 200 pounds, and that's why you can't move anything in your body. You're just sinking into the floor, sinking, sinking, sinking. And a couple more little breaths, just regular natural breathing. Just don't push it, just allow your body to breathe. And then slowly, you just wanna to start to wiggle your fingers and toes a little bit, just to feel the lightness of the body and the surface of the body. And then stretch your arms over your head like you're waking up in the morning. So we can really wake up the body and stretch out those abdominals that we worked so hard. You can let your eyes open or keep them closed, whatever's more relaxed for you. And then hug your knees to your chest, give them a squeezy squeeze in. And then roll onto your side and push yourself up to sitting. And let's just sit for a second in a very comfortable cross-legged position and just take a big stretch up, inhale. And exhale, let it go. Great job, all done. Uh, Boys and girls, if you got through this yoga session successfully, give yourselves a nice round of applause. Thank you, well done. That is not easy. Now remember to drink plenty of water before, during, and especially after exercise. You want to make sure that you're having little sippies of water, not big, big gulps, but little sippies. Now, for those of you out there that were not able to complete everything in this particular yoga session, that is okay, because here at Super Kids, all that we really care about is that you at home just give it your best with every single video that we offer. Now with that said, boys and girls, we've got lots more videos headed your way, so make sure you're checking those out because each and every video is very different from the next. Okay, boys and girls, I have a question. What do you call a worm with a fur coat? With a caterpillar. <laughs> I'm TJ, the Rick and Until next time, bye-bye.